welcome on my channel this is twin flame tarot reading and this is divine masculine messages to divine feminine whenever you click this video it's going to resonate with you with your love situation with your twin flame uh, this is second part of the video if you want to watch first part of the video you can click on the link in the description so now we are continuing with this uh, part two Divine Feminine, what we got already is that, with these fortune teller cards, is that Divine Masculine is going through karmic situation. This karmic situation, he choosing because he's empty. He feel completely empty. He cannot find satisfaction in anything, even he choosing somebody else. This should calm you, and you shouldn't afraid of this phase. If Divine Masculine is with another person, is Divine Masculine choosing friends, is Divine Masculine choosing third party uh, to cheat on you, to, you know, to be always in some challenges and uh, some temptations, you don't need to Focus yourself on that. You don't need to do anything to stop that, to change this person because you cannot do that. You cannot stop that. So Divine Feminine, you have to detach completely. You have to focus on yourself. You know, in this reading, we got some important messages in the first part of the video is that, you know, God advising you to focus on yourself, on something what is very important right now in 3D, uh, what's going on in your world, you know, what's going on with your financial situation, with your stability. If you have to pay some bills, if you have some legal issues, legal problems, focus on that, you know, uh, clear that things, you know, so you can uh, be calm after because you giving too much energy to divine masculine, to this karmic person or karmic situation in divine masculine life, and, you know, you ignoring other important things, this and other important things cannot wait anymore. You have some problems, and you have to work on that. You have to uh, fix that things, you know, because, you know what? This is serious. This is serious. This is why you got, got this card of judgment, what tells you, you have to do something for yourself. This is this have nothing with divine masculine. This have nothing with another person with your twin flame journey. This is something else. What you have been put on the side and you totally forgot about that. That is very important things. So divine feminine, if you focus yourself on that things, you know divine masculine will come back to you, because when you detaching from divine masculine. Divine Masculine will not give uh, intention to this karmic person. He will detach himself from that karmic person, from karmic situation, and automatically this person will go in your direction. This person will be again in union, in reunion with you. Call it the way you want it, but this person will come back into your life. This is how things are going between twin flames. And if that doesn't happen then you have to accept that you are in karmic connection, that you are not between flame. So if you detaching from divine masculine completely, you working on that, you don't think about that person, you, you, you don't have that obsessive mind, obsessive thinking, you're not chasing them, you're not doing love of attraction, you're not doing anything toward this person, you're focusing on, other, on another, uh, you know, important things, what is in your life, you know, you're working on something and, you know, if for that time this person doesn't back to you, then, then you have to think twice. You have to think twice. Who is that person? Did you was misguided? Did you was misleaded? Who was guiding you? Who was telling you that this is your twin flame? Because twin flame can't live without you. Your twin flame is somebody who can't live without that flame 
what they can receive only from you. Two of you are same soul. Your twin flame cannot live without you. So put that in the comment as affirmation. No matter what's going on here, your twin flame can't live without you. Put that in the comment as affirmation. We are continuing with this reading, Divine Feminine. I'm getting here that you will get communication. You will get text message or phone call from Divine Masculine. This is what will happen here. Even Divine Masculine is seeing somebody else. Even Divine Masculine is, uh, you know, focusing on somebody else. You will get communication that gonna be video call or voice call or this person will come directly to your doors something will happen because this person is so sad without you do you see this this person is so sad without you this person love you this person have feelings for you and they are unhappy this person is totally empty they are totally sad you saw this energy, it was on screen. Like this video to invite positive energy and to receive positive energy from me. This is very important, Divine Feminine. You see, there is card of thief in reverse. So whoever was deceptive, whoever was toxic, whoever was, you know, stealing your happiness, that's going to be over. You know, if this Divine Masculine was hiding himself, you know, this Divine Masculine didn't want to tell you truth. You know, truth will come to you. Truth will come to you. Put that in the comment as affirmation. Truth will come to you and union, union will come to you. You see, union with Divine Feminine and Divine Masculine is here in this reading. This, this is what will happen. This is in the middle of the reading. This is card of Twin Flames. This is card of Yin and Yang energy. You have to balance yourself. You got this Libra, this judgment card. You got this card of Twin Flames, but confirms you that, you know, two of you will be in the balance. For some of you, you have to wait a little bit longer, you know, because Divine Masculine focusing on that karmic person. But look, for some of you, there is pure feelings, but they cannot forget. Pure feelings, but what is between two of you. And this Divine Masculine still want to marry you, even if this connection is on the end, even if they have been cutting communication with you, even if they have been blocking you, even if they are totally done with you, even if they told to everybody, I'm done with Divine Feminine, I'm not going to marry Divine Feminine. You know, this is, you know, what you can expect, even if, if connection is dead. You understand? Uh, for many of you, you can deal with Scorpio, with Sagittarius, with Leo, with Gemini, with Pisces, with Libra. The deck is closed. The deck don't want to speak. So there's something what's coming to you and it can be connected with, uh, you know, with proposal, with engagement, with wedding. If Divine Masculine have been promising you that, trust me, even he's seeing somebody else, he have regret, you know, because... He's saying to himself, I'm empty. I'm not proud of myself what I'm doing right now. Why I'm seeing somebody else? Why I am why I am in, with somebody else in relationship? Why I giving attention to somebody else? He will speak to you. He will clear things with you. Sooner or later, that will happen. Let's see with another card. You see tower moment, breakups, you know, breakups, separation. So... Many of you who are going to watch this video, you know, you are right now in this tower moment. You are stressed. You are in panic. You, you are in shock, you know, because of something that was happened. Maybe Divine Masculine really was proposing you already, but because of some reasons, this person is still in some karmic depths, in some karmic connections. They still didn't finish with that karmic cycle. For some of you, you have to wait things. You have to wait New Year. You have to wait 31 December. You have to wait 1st January. 
2023 depend when you're watching this video this is timeless we are making this video in april 2022 there is tower why we have this tower what is that was going on here well you see this so for many of you even if you're thinking the connection is over this divine masculine will come back to you and there will be engagement there will be commitment between two of you there is card of 11 11 number four number 22 four of flames four of wands this person loves you this person wants to build family with you king of cups this is a water sign cancer pisces scorpio we have in this reading also fire sign we have Aries, Sagittarius, Leo. Number four is very important for this reading. Oh my God. Oh my God. Again, fire sign. Strongly Leo. Leo, Sagittarius, Aries. Look. It could be divine feminine that you're going to be on the crossroad. You have to make decision. Should you choose water sign or fire sign? Is this person for you? Or is this person for you? Maybe this connection between water sign and fire sign. Maybe this connection is... Maybe this connection is so strong that they cannot forget you. These two kings are on same level. They respect each other. They love each other. They have strong feelings for, the, for each other. This is not page of cups or, or, or page of wands. This is not knight of cups or knight of wands. This is king of cups and king of wands. These cards are in upright position all these cards came in upright position this is so strong so for some of you you have two options would you choose your soulmate or would you choose your twin flame or you know two of you are for each other because there is so strong energy what i'm picking like two kings like two kings it means that, that both of you, both of you, already choosing each other. It's done. It's done. Divine masculine choosing divine feminine. Divine feminine choosing divine masculine. There is four of ones between two of you. There is commitment. There is reunion. You will be in this tower because... In that moment, it could be that two of you will be on the crossroad. Because of who? Because of you. Not because of some karmic person from Divine Masculine Life. You can be on the crossroad because you have to make decision. Will you choose water sign or fire sign? Two kings for you. Two strong personalities. These two kings are very strong powerful they know what they want they know where they're standing they're gonna come to you stable so probably divine masculine will come back to you when he's finally king when he's finally strong and he's walking on strong foundation when he knows what he wants so divine family don't force this connection this divine masculine will come to you when he's ready but in that time somebody else will also fight for you so you will have two options for many of you for others of you this is connection between water sign and fire sign both of you need time to make things right like you need strong foundation you need to become strong and powerful they have to so there is reason why this separation is between two of you divine family let's move on another cards I hope this video is not going to turn off. If that's happen, it is because my energy is so strong. 
why we have two kings oh my god libra again so for some of you you're not gonna be able to make decision maybe you will be in third party you will you will be between two options between two um, masculine energies yes you see seven of swords maybe you will be the one who will say now i'm going through you know through the third party and now you have to wait me to make decision so for some of you you're gonna do like that i see this if divine masculine is in karmic situation then you're gonna focus on somebody else but is that good for you divine family think about that you don't need to find somebody just to find somebody to to have somebody beside you when you are alone you don't need that better focus on yourself work on yourself do good things for yourself and by the time this person this twin flame will come back to you they're gonna remove mask you see we got this card this is same completely same you see this person hiding himself behind this puppet behind his mask and here you can see this person also hiding his face so whatever they have been hiding sooner or later god will show you truth you have to be in balance do not allow this card of uh, of uh, judgment to be in reverse position uh, this libra must be in upright position maybe you are libra maybe you cannot make decisions maybe you know you lost yourself on your twin flame journey do not lose yourself i i know that this person do not speak truth they don't ha they hiding truth from you but you have to wait you have to wait for some of you there is nine days uh, nine weeks nine months depend you know you have to weigh this you have to weigh this there is moon you have peers for some of you your water sign you're connected with this person through water element so strongly this person can be fire sign or water sign or you can be water sign or this person can be uh water sign or fire sign but you know two of you are compatible in the moon so both of you can have a fire sign in moon or water sign uh in moon oh my god ring oh my god divine feminine you are afraid that they're gonna propose somebody else but look this person this person will propose you you will get two offers you will get two offers divine feminine you will get two offers from somebody who who making plans they're not gonna tell you this they're not gonna tell you they're gonna sit in this boat in this canoe and they're gonna go to you they're not gonna tell you that number six number eight six we have sign uh, what is connected symbol what is connected with cancer you can be cancer water sign we have moon we have a uh, number one eight five three one 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 four there is separation so somebody who is far away from you this person want to come oh my oh my god king of wands again king of wands two times in upright position and in reverse so this person maybe lost confidence maybe they will come back to you when you completely detach you know then uh, they will feel oh my god now i'm in challenge you know this divine feminine don't chase me anymore i will bring back divine feminine into my life so this is what can happen divine feminine if you listen to me if you detaching from divine masculine this is what will happen okay you have to detach from divine masculine let's see do we have time for one more card so strongly fire sign we have getting to know each other you know now maybe you will see truth of this person now when they remove that mask completely you will know this person for some of you there will be uh healing family issues so they have to heal family issues you have to heal family issues we also have engagement in reverse so for some of you yes there is ring and engagement maybe they have been broke up engagement maybe they told you that they will marry you and something was happened but this person will come back this engagement is just in delay they still wanna marry you they still wanna engage with you this was reading for you divine feminine i hope this ring will happen oh my god wedding congratulations god bless in the name of god son of god and holy spirit amen i wish this to happen to you i wish you to marry your divine masculine put this as affirmation in the comment divine masculine will marry me thank you so much for watching for listening hope this reading will guide you in the right direction you can contact me on my email if you need extended reading if you need my guidance 
see you next time bye i'm so happy for you for this card thank you so much see you next time bye